explaining serving sizes like you know just kind of an informational video <laughs> that I thought would be kind of interesting because you know nobody ever pays attention to serving sizes on foods they just kind of pour how much they want and then eat that but I want to go over how much you're supposed to have and I have a select few things out that we can go over I so we'll just get started on that. We're gonna first start with ice cream because I don't want it to melt. So it says serving size two thirds cup. I usually do like three scoops. That's like me cutting down on ice cream. <laughs> So this, oh wait, this is the wrong side. It's about two thirds. So this is how much ice cream you're supposed to have. That's like a scoop and a half. And I usually have three. Next subject, we are gonna do milk because that's another cold thing I don't want to get warm. And it says serving size, one cup. Usually there's two meanings of one cup. For me, one cup, a cup of milk is this. I just have that. You know, you will have that for dinner. So what you're supposed to have is this. And I usually fill it to like there. So it's about half of what I drink. Next is pea. But don't eat these, really. But I'm still gonna show you how much you should have. So it says on here. Oh, I'm gonna it down. So we this two thirds cup. So same thing with the ice cream. It's supposed to have as much ice cream as you have peas. Whoa. That's a lot. There. That is about two thirds. Okay, I guess it's a little under two thirds. That's about two thirds. So yeah, that's how, many, how much peas you should be having. I can't really judge about it because I don't know how much I would have because I don't eat peas, but I would say my family pretty much has this amount on their plates. Probably this amount or less. So y'all should be having more peas. <laughs> Next we are going on to cereal. This is my favorite cereal, Captain Crunch. Um, so serving size three fourths of a cup. So let's measure it out and then I'll pour it into a bowl to see how much, how much the difference is. that 
I usually fill it up to like Okay, on the camera it looks like it should be normal, but like I fill up my cereal up to like the rim right here. That is so small. That's a really small amount of cereal. I think I've been eating way too much cereal. Ugh. Sometimes I have this more than like once a day, so I fill it up to the top. Pretty much overflowing. More than once. So I'm having like four servings in one day. Okay, and lastly, pasta. I'm using the Thai pasta because I just used some yesterday and I like Botox. So the serving size is, um, it says one and one fourth cup. I'm gonna get a plate. And show you. And this is dry, so whenever it's dry, this is how much you should put into it. It's one and one fourth. And that's about one fourth. That's actually a lot more pasta than I kind of thought of it. I mean, I had more pasta yesterday when I actually made it. I have like a whole bunch, just kind of poured a whole bunch in. So that's how much pasta you should be having. About that much. Okay, so that's it for the, ser the serving size video. I don't really know anybody who else has done this. I just kind of thought it'd be interesting if somebody else has done it, then <laughs> oh well. This is kind of my version of it. Um, hope you found it interesting. Maybe it'll encourage you to eat less or more of things. For this week's shout out is Gregory Rumor. I figured he kind of, it's finally time that he gets shout out. Um, he's been a huge help. He's awesome. <laughs> we went, I went to school with him, like I think junior high and high school. And he always told people that they were awesome. So I think he deserves more than the, just this video shout out. Um, I couldn't find him on Twitter. I don't know if he has a Twitter or whatever. So I just took a screenshot of his YouTube channel. Thank you for the support. Keep at it. Make sure to subscribe. Subscribe to Kirby and Shay. Subscribe to Shay. Uh, yeah, that's it for this video. Love you guys. Bye.